Martin Va Agus Fauci Gu and Tashpanach Akin. Good morning and welcome to our presentation about our Gaelan Butte. Our Gaelan Butte Council area is on the west coast of Scotland and has a reputation as the gateway to the Isles. Did you know we are the second largest local authority area in Scotland and have the fourth sparsest population density of the 32 Scottish local authorities? Our population here in our Gaelan Butte is approximately 85,500. We have 23 inhabited islands, including Butte, Isla, Jura, Mull, Iona, Col, and Tyree, and 17% of our population live on the islands. We do have social work staff living on working on some of the islands, such as Mull, Tyree, Butte, and Isla, and the other islands are served by visiting staff from the mainland using any means of travel available to them. So quite often it can be trains, planes and automobiles, but actually no, we don't have any trains going over to the islands, but we do have ferries instead. In one area, we also have the bridge over the Atlantic. But don't be worried, as we also have trains in our urban areas. We also have urban areas in our Gaelan Butte, like Helensburgh and Dunoon, which are along the Clyde, and Loch Lomond to the east of Helensburgh. We have Oban in the northwest of our Gaelan Butte, Campbelltown in the south, and in the middle we have Loch Gilphead. Employment in our Gaelan Butte, there's quite a lot to choose from. Our Gaelan Butte Council is obviously one of the biggest employers throughout the area, but we also have a lot of other industries and opportunities for couples and families who are interested in the lifestyle that the area of our Gaelan Butte can offer. The key sectors of our economy include renewable energy, manufacturing and generation, marine sciences, marine services, quality food and drink, including agriculture and aquaculture, tourism, creative industries, including film and forestry. Our public sector organisations are operating across our Gael and we offer opportunities in a range of fields, including public administration, education, health, and emergency services. We have one acute hospital in our Gaelan Butte and that's based in Oban. We have community hospitals in Campbelltown, Loch Gilphead, Dunoon and on the islands of Isla, Butte and Mull. We've got whiskey distilleries on the islands of Isla and Jura, also on the mainland in Oban. We have Calmac who operate our ferries as well as western ferries in the Cowl area. We have an airport from Connell, which is near Oban, which goes to all our smaller islands such as Col, Collinsey, Tyree and Isla. So for social work opportunities in our Gaelan Butte, we have social work teams that are field specific. We have children and families social work teams, community justice, mental health, learning disabilities, adult care, dementia, addictions and sensory impairment teams. We also have internal care homes for older people and for young people who are care experienced. A rural children and family social work across our teams offers the opportunity to develop knowledge and skills across the full range of children and family support and processes, including supporting children in need, child protection and managing core processes within the care experience journey from first concern through to adoption. Within adult care, all social workers are supported through learning and development to become council officers under adult support and protection, with opportunities to special in areas such as mental health, adult protection and so on. Career progression is supported through a strategic training and development plan, including post-qualifying awards, and with opportunities to specialise in chosen fields, as well as leadership and management. We have a dedicated social work training board who are committed to supporting staff to achieve the requirement of the Scottish Social Services Council continuous professional learning requirement as a minimum to support staff to achieve their developmental aspirations, maintain and improve their knowledge and skills and enable a progressive developmental and career pathway. 
for newly qualified social workers were part of the, the Scottish Social Services Council supported year pilot, which is in partnership with Highland, Moray and Shetland Councils, and have a programme to support you that reflects some of the uniqueness of island and rural social work, as well as your transition to becoming a newly qualified social worker. We also offer student placements and have internal practice educators and assessors. So why come to Argyll and Butte? The salary for a newly qualified social worker starts at thirty-six thousand six hundred and ninety-nine to thirty-nine thousand seven hundred and sixty-five pound per annum for a thirty-five hour week. If you're thinking of a career with our Gallen Butte Council, we can help you with relocation expenses. There's also a host of other benefits such as a general annual leave, final salary pension, and group life assurance schemes. The option of flexible work patterns or job share and where appropriate car lease schemes and other allowances. We also have specialist staff benefit company which gives our Gallen Butte Council employees access to various schemes such as leisure and retail vouchers and discounts, technology products, scheme and cycle to work schemes. If you'd like more information about our Gallen Butte please contact Lorna Clark at lorna.clark2 at argyle-butte.gov.uk or call her on 01546 604 348. We have a website in Argyle and Butte called A Place to Be. On that website you'll find more information about living and working in Argyle and Butte. And there is a quote from a graduate who chose to move to Argyll and Butte. And what she says is, I chose Argyll because Argyll and Butte Council is a great employer for young graduates. The council has really invested in me in terms of time, mentoring and training. I really feel that they've helped me forge a career in the public sector. So now you've heard a bit about Argyll and Butte Council. Thank you for taking the time to listen. And I'd like to offer you the opportunity to ask any questions that you may have. Thank you.